Hi, I'm Jen Humberstone, Fisheries Project Director with The Nature Conservancy. Every year, fishing gear is accidentally lost, set adrift by storms, or inadvertently moved by passing vessels. Lost gear poses a navigational hazard for vessels, impacts marine habitat, and can inadvertently trap or entangle marine life, including whales. In fact, accidental entanglement in fishing gear and marine debris is a leading source of human-caused mortality to whales worldwide. And in recent years, whale entanglements have increased drastically off the U.S. West Coast. Getting lost fishing gear out of the water and out of the way of whales is an essential part of the solution to achieve better outcomes for marine life and for fishermen. Many marine debris removal programs are shore-based and grant-dependent, failing to scale to match the size of the problem or endure over time. We partnered with representatives from the Half Moon Bay Commercial Fisheries Trust and the Half Moon Bay Seafood Marketing Association to create a new model for lost gear recovery. Together, we designed a scalable program that is fishing industry-led, financially viable, and streamlined with use of a new web and phone application called Crab Gear. Hi, I'm Lisa Damrosh, Executive Director of the Half Moon Bay Seafood Marketing Association and Port Coordinator for the Half Moon Bay Lost Gear Recovery Project. Let me tell you how it works. There are three main steps in the program. First, recruit a local lost gear recovery team. Second, recover lost gear. And third, return recovered gear for a fee. A port coordinator oversees all program operations, including recruiting commercial fishermen to recover lost fishing gear outside of the fishing season in exchange for cash. The California Department of Fish and Wildlife recently formalized the crab industry-led lost gear recovery program as a state-sanctioned program. In 2020, seven of the nine major crab ports participated and reported recovery of more than 630 lost traps. Since 2015, we've recovered more than 2,000 traps. That's over 100 tons of marine debris removed by fishermen from our coastal waters. This industry-led and self-funding model has proven effective with promise to scale for use in other fisheries in California and around the world. To learn more or get involved, visit our website or get in touch via email.